morning. Thanks for joining us for Local 3 News. I'm Brianna McLean. On the first day of the year, you're invited to get outside and be part of the National First Day Hikes program hosted by America State Parks. The DNR says you can hike, cross-country ski, snowshoe, or ride bikes or horses. Whatever the distance or however you do it, if your goal is to be more active. The DNR says it's a great way to be focused on your health, but in a fun way. Well, we also have some really great destinations in Michigan for snowshoeing. Like, um, I actually often suggest to people, consider going to a closed campground. So the campground might be closed, but often they keep the uh, parking lots plowed. So you can just strap on your snowshoes and enjoy a really beautiful hike through a wooded area. But know that you're, you know, if you're not looking for super adventurous, you can get uh, back to your car pretty easily. The DNR has a list of winter activities online. There are planned events scheduled through March, or you can choose virtual options to go whenever works for you. The UP Regional Blood Center is experiencing a critical need for all blood types. Donations can be made at collection sites in Marquette, Escanaba, and Hancock. UP Regional Blood Center supplies blood to 13 hospitals in the Upper Peninsula. For hours and scheduling, call Marquette at 906-449-1450, Hancock at 906-483-1392, and Escanaba at 906-786-8420. Zero. Now for a check on your forecast with meteorologist Tom Kippen. Thanks a lot, Bree. Here's what's ahead for today. Temperatures, albeit it's a cold start, won't be as cold this afternoon. Look for high temperatures in the 20s to around 30. Could start to see some snow move into the UP this afternoon, and some of that snow will continue into tonight. Snow chances continue through the holiday weekend, but otherwise, outside of the snow chances, it's going to be cold, perhaps very cold, for the New Year's holiday. For weather anytime, if you're on the go today or for the New Year's holiday, download our free WJMN Local 3 app, also online at upmatters.com. That's where we do have an interactive radar at the bottom of the weather page. You can track any snow and we're on Facebook as well.